When you think of U.S. cities with art scenes that are on point, New York, Los Angeles, and Chicago may come to mind. But in the last few years, murals, or street art in the Summit City, has gotten into a groove all its own. We check out Art This Way for this morning's Positively Fort Wayne. I'm a full-time artist. I've been doing this for five years. With a stroke of her brush. I like painting large, I like making it big. And a rainbow of colors. It was just a fluke and a, a crazy <laughs> circumstance that really brought me into the scenario. Fort Wayne artist Alexandra Hall not only decks the walls and halls of hospitals. I have a large mural at Lutheran Hospital here in town. But rocks downtown Fort Wayne alleys and buildings as well. This is a work that I did in collaboration with Alex Mendez. He's a sculptor based in Decatur, Indiana. It was something I'd made for an event called Art Prize up in Grand Rapids, Michigan. And it just so happened to be on display and uh, Downtown Improvement District saw it. Alex is a very talented person. And Bill Brown orchestrated uh, the purchase of it with the Friends of Lincoln Financial as part of a, a memorial fund that they had for Christy Landrigan. Christy unfortunately died in a, a car accident back in uh, around 2014, I believe it was. She really wanted to get people connected to downtown to tell the downtown story. And she also worked as, at Lincoln Financial as a uh, financial advisor. She was also with downtown Fort Wayne several years. So Christy, is Christy kind of at the core? Of so uh, Christy's memory is at the core of the very beginning of all of this, yes. Mm -hmm. And from this collaboration, the Downtown Improvement District's Art This Way was born from a woman who wanted to revive downtown through a woman who is. It is very much a... Uh, a vicarious relationship that uh, she's ex exuding because of her friendship and relationship with Christy. Alex is Art This Way's co-founder and manager. We've really come a long way in a very short time. Alex isn't the only artist whose work you'll find downtown. Others also have theirs in full bloom. There are more than 12, but here in the Art This Way program, we installed four this last year. You'll find these artful expressions within a two-block area of downtown that runs from Washington, Wayne and Barry, and Harrison and Calhoun. We have a lot of local talent that uh, is really great at expressing themselves uh, through that visual medium. Property owners within this area signed agreements for their buildings to become canvases. It's really something to have the local owners really step up and say, we're interested in seeing this happen too. Please saturate this space with uh, some creativity. We're excited about this next year's projects. Uh, hopefully we'll see another mural installed in June or July of this year. Alex has no plans to put her likeness on a building, but it was on a different type of canvas. In 2018, Fort Wayne Magazine honored her as one of its People of the Year, an artist bringing art this way that is positively Fort Wayne. Hopefully Art This Way will continue to bring more artwork to downtown. Artists interested in creating murals can turn in applications. On Wayne.com you'll find a link to get more information. Just go to Positively Fort Wayne under the News tab and find the story. And join me, Dirk, and the Evening News team tonight at 5, 6, and 11. A recap of this morning's top stories when First News returns.